Since time immemorial, people have cohabited and lived in places far away from their origins. This is often the case with many Igbo people, as their businesses and entrepreneurial nature takes them across different borders. With this comes the reason to have a leadership structure that sees to the affairs of the members from its people, especially when they are in foreign land. My twin brother, as a high center, has located it and uh, handed over to me. I did it. Now I'm handing over to him as the chairman. Amen. So I thank the new executives for coming on board. I ask them to continue what they know how to do best to lead India in our hands to the next level. God bless our work. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, which is the apex Igbo social cultural group in Nigeria, stands to represent all Igbo communities within and outside Nigeria, as well as in different states of the Federation. My name is uh, Eze Sa Christopher, a maker of fear, KSM, Eze Ndibu in Ibejuleki, Chairman, Council of India's and Lagos State, Ono Wegele, and Otumba Taisho in Ibeju. Today is the first meeting we are having for this year after our const constituted uh, council on 17th of last month, November. And uh, we decided to have a forum today, a general meeting of Ndeze, Lagos State. I want to use it at the same time to do a press conference that uh, the button has been changed for good and to move on go forward. The body sees to the affair of its members, cater to their needs when necessary, and create oneness among Igbo and non Igbo. <laughs> Bukaena Abo Press Conference on the 17th of last month, being Nove November 2020. At about this time, we were constituted. We are trying to address one of a few conceived anomalies, you know, people used as soft spot to fight in the past. Uh, we have been following the Igbo movement in Lagos for some time and we see that people have been in the habit of saying that Igbos are fighting or that they are misunderstanding themselves for one thing or the other. And uh, we have been able to prove today that we have transcended certain areas this is the third time consecutively we are having a new chairman from Omeraha to Wachuku to as a Christopher Ophia now. So put together it's now more than seven years we've now moved this association without fight. So this is the kind of inauguration of new escorts for Ndiaze Ndibo in Lagos State. This gathering is the sub body of one Nese Ndibo called the Eze Indigbo in council, whose role and objective of creation is to foster unity among its members in different local government areas. This is the first general meeting under the new leadership of Eze Christopher Ophia, chairman of the council of Ndiaze in Lagos State. We all about charity. Charity is our watchword, it's our priority. Uh, I have uh, one simple thing to tell Ndigbo, that Ndigbo will go to a greater height under my leadership, culturally, socially, and uh, politically, we are going to go far. And at the end of the day, they will be happy that they have a newly constituted ESCO. Issues discussed at the meeting include pros and cons of the council, as well as the activities, duties, challenges, and prospects of the ASEs in Lagos State.